All right, to be fair, I'm not the biggest fan of the PlayStation controller, so I'm excited to show you what I think is one of the best game controllers out right now. So the folks at Astro sent over the C40 TR game controller. It's their brand new game controller. And I have to say, man, I've been impressed using this controller. Retails for $199. Now, this is not the packaging you're seeing. This is like a special edition they sent over. I want to thank them for that. Um, and they had a few extras there, like extra um, uh, thumbsticks, low, high, medium. So I had extra ones in terms of height if I want, want that. I also got an extra uh, faceplate and extra D-pad, but uh, D-pad faces. But the controller box is really nice it's compact it's got like the like original astro colors in there and of course it comes with a hard shell carrying case which houses all the things you need it's got a wi-fi dongle we'll get to that in a second it's got a, a removal tool so you can customize the faceplate you can see when you spread everything out this is everything you have in there and of course the few extras i have so that's not all you do have in there uh and of course a micro usb cable for this now the controller itself when you you feel it compared to the PlayStation 4 controller, it feels really different. It doesn't have the same style and it has more something close to like the uh, the uh, the Pro Controller and the Nintendo uh, the Nintendo Switch or even like an Xbox controller. I like the feel. Um, as a Pro Controller, it feels really nice and weighted, not too heavy, not too light. You've got, of course, all your buttons here. Uh, everything in the front face place can be remapped or moved around. So you can move the position of your uh, left or right uh, thumbsticks, your D-pad, uh, your buttons there. We can move the location anywhere you want to, which is actually pretty cool. Moving that faceplate is easy with the tool that's provided. And also, uh, it's easy to actually just pop that out. You can see there's a red line marker that says, hey, place it right there. And then you can pop up, of course, your uh, thumbsticks and replace that. It's so easy with this stuff, I'm telling you. It is really, really easy. Now, of course, you've got your triggers. You've got your uh, shoulder pad shoulders and your triggers here. Your triggers can, of course, you've got trigger locks for those as well. So you can set that and use, especially if you're using you know, in a FPS game. If you're using a driving game, you might want to keep it there, which is fine. And then you've got remappable buttons at the very bottom of the controller, which is nice. And I like the feel because I my hands don't interfere with them. And it doesn't matter if I grip in claw or I you know if I grip like this or I grip like this. I still get to be able to hit those buttons anyway. Really nice design and that faceplate though, like seriously, the red faceplate, that is pretty cool. Anyway, this thing is dope. Like when I say you can remap all the buttons, you can do that on the software. You can remap the button functionality from L1 to be X or vice versa, it doesn't matter. You can also remap um, your sensitivity for your thumbsticks. So you can actually have more or less pressure. So if you, you want to basically put less pressure, but also cover more distance, you can do that and vice versa. You can do that also with the triggers so that when you put a trigger lock on there, if you'd like to do that, you can still increase the travel distance for it as well. Well, that is pretty cool. Plus, it's got a headphone jack, a 3.5 mm jack. You could connect, connect to your Astro, um, say like the A40 uh, TRs, and then get some really good audio, the same quality audio as if you were plugged in directly to uh, the console because it's a Wi-Fi module here. It's not Bluetooth, it's not compressed audio, it's clean all the way through. Plus, you can customize your EQs, your side tone, all that fun stuff and save it under controller. Speaking of that, the controller has two profiles we can switch through on the fly. It's saved right on the controller, so if you're playing something like Battlefield, you can switch from driving and into, say, flying an aircraft where you want it to be inverted. Boom, hit the switch, you're inverted. Doesn't matter. It's that simple, it's that easy. I really enjoyed using this controller. I think, you know, Sam came over, he was playing, uh, doing just good, some gameplay sessions and he was playing some God of War. It felt really comfortable, He's that's what he said. I also really like it. It's very comfortable for me. I like the fact that I can move the buttons and I also like the fact that it just feels, it feels solid in my hand, you know, when I'm gaming. So that's, that's really cool. Uh, I think a lot of gamers will like this controller. If you're a PlayStation ga uh, player, you also do a lot of PC gaming, you like to use a controller, this is probably the controller you want to go with. That uh, Wi-Fi dongle is marvelous, lots of distance. I can't remember what they stated, but I have walked out of my apartment and still connect. Actually, we tested that out. So I think this is something that a lot of gamers will definitely like. 
And if you want to pick it up, use the link down below. I, look, I love this controller. Hopefully you like it too. If you have any questions, any comments about the Astro C40TR uh, game controller, basically tournament ready controller, let me know. Otherwise, don't forget to like and share, subscribe to the channel, and always enjoy your entertainment.